All right, we're going to demonstrate how to trim a lower model using a basic model trimmer. Uh, remember to turn the water on, both the water at the back of the wall, the main water source, as well as the flow knob to a decent rate so that it doesn't get embedded inside the grooves on the wheel. You want to make sure that your model has been soaked in water. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to trim the back portion or the heels of the model and then stand it up on this table here and make sure that it is straight so that everything else that we trim is straight along with it. So trimming the heels first. Apply even pressure on both sides, not favoring one side or the other, and place it against the grinding wheel. Make sure that it's stable at all times. Laying it on the grinding table, provided with the grinding disc or machine, make sure that it's standing up and that it is even. At this point, you place your fingers on the occlusal surfaces of the teeth. You can advance the model towards the disc to grind the bottom portion of the model. Your gloves should be fairly tight and not loose so as to get caught down in between the table and the grinding wheel. Applying even pressure on both sides or a thumb on both sides, you're going to push it into the table. You'll see it's starting to grind off the bottom of the model very evenly and uniformly. The more pressure you apply, the quicker it will grind off. And then you can trim the sides by either placing it on the table and advancing it towards the disc. Now it's hard to see the buckle side of the teeth from here, so you may want to tilt the model, but make sure that you have a good grip on the model when you do so. And that is about as rough a trim as we want on our models. And then you'll just rinse it off after this.